Fans waited outside Radio Music City Music Hall, excuse me, in New York last night to see their favorite stars at the premiere of Sgt. Pepper's Lonely Hearts Club Band. The movie features Peter Frampton and the nation's hottest rock group, the Bee Gees. Here's more in this report. Frampton followers, Bee Gees worshippers, Alice Cooper cultists, thousands of them showed up outside of Radio City Music Hall to wait patiently for a glimpse of a great one, any great one. And when the limousines cruised up, there was Sergeant Pepper's weather vane, also known as Billy Preston. What do you think about the movie? I think it's fantastic. Why? Because I'm in it. <laughs> no, no, because it's, it's the Beatles songs, you know, that makes this movie so fantastic. And all the beautiful people in it, you know, I'm proud to be a part of it. George Burns, accompanied by his ever-present blonde companion, was in good spirits. How are you doing? Good. I'm all excited. I'm getting in for free. <laughs> in the film, Alice Cooper plays evil. He turns people's minds to jelly. What do you think about the movie? I think I'm evil in it. Oh, you mean to be? Yes, I'm very mean in it. But Frampton never showed up. He's still in the hospital recuperating from an auto accident. And horror of horrors, the Bee Gees slipped in through a side door. And I have some very bad news. I have just been informed that the Bee Gees are already inside. You're kidding. No, no, no. We've been here all day. No. It's only premiere. I mean, that's ridiculous. What's the premiere for? 